Okay, I'll just show you how to set the sat nav in this 2014 BMW X5. So from any screen, you've got nav just here, uh, the second one back on the right. So click on nav. If you click it again, you've then got destination input. The, the menu comes up, so we want destination input. And across here, place and postcode, place and so that comes onto the rotary control. We're Grosvenor Garage, Chorley Road, Wantonydale, Preston, P, R. Now we need the numbers. What we need to do is turn this down to highlight the bottom there, further characters. And then we click on that. That, that highlights the numeric display. So it's PR5, 4. It's defaulted back to letters. J, S, and then we click OK. There's an OK symbol in the center. That's it. We can put the street in. I don't want to put the street in and, and the house number. I just turn it down to start guidance. Click start guidance. That's it, selected fast route. Okay, I'll just show you how to delete a mobile from the Bluetooth audio system in this 2014 BMW X5. Uh, any screen, you can either click the menu in the center there, the center button and go to telephone, select telephone or you can just click telephone, <laughs> the easiest way. And then you've got phone book, last number redial, receive calls, dial number, and Bluetooth devices. That's what we want, Bluetooth devices. Add new device, but it also shows a list of paired devices. My phone's paired there, that's the one I want to delete. So I highlight that, and then I click the rotary control towards me. It's not immediately obvious there, because you've got the split screen, switch off control display, but here, if we navigate down you've got configure device or remove device now if you go into configure there you go you can select whether you want it to to use it as a telephone or audio and um, so if you if you can't stream music or anything like that go into that setting and, and just make sure there's a tick there so Barry's iPhone we highlight it tick over to the right down to remove device click remove device and it's gone that's it Okay, I'll just show you how to pair a mobile to the Bluetooth audio system in this 2014 BMW X5. Uh, first of all, we make sure that Bluetooth is on, like so. Bluetooth's on, and then we're watching out at the bottom here. Over to the iDrive, the rotary control here. And telephone is the top right-hand one, or you can go to menu. Telephone's easier, so we click telephone. That same Bluetooth menu. On to Bluetooth menu. And there we've got the choice. You can either select any of those which would normally have a phones in, but there's, there's none in this, it's empty, or add new device. So we're clicking add new device. Please use your Bluetooth device to start search for Bluetooth devices. The vehicle will identify itself as BMW 77602. And as you can see there, that's at the bottom. So we click on that. You see there the um, little circular thing spinning round looking for it bluetooth pairing request so you've got 093062 does it match yes pair and then click ok with the iDrive allow contacts and favorites to sync allow that's it it's showing connected here just taking a little time to uh check everything out on the audio system and there you see as i was saying before telephone and audio both of those are ticked so we'll be able to answer and make calls and stream audio with those two ticked that's it that's uh, that's it done that's it selected okay i'll just show you how to stream music through the bluetooth audio system in this 2014 bmw x5 so from any screen first of all we go over to music and, and whatever you want to to play so there we go. That's the record that's playing oh, Thunderball Tom Jones at the moment. You see there at the bottom, BMW. If I click on that, it shows you there's a tick next to the BMW system or this iPhone. The tick was there, it would only play through, through the phone. This, any music, any audio that's coming through your phone, if you have the system set properly, it will play through the speakers in the car. So that's it, there's a tick there. We'll go back, we'll click play. I'm gonna turn this down so I don't get a copyright strike. 
but that's playing at the moment. Now we have to go to the audio system and, and set it to receive this, the Bluetooth signal. So over we go to the iDrive, click media. You see there, auxiliary and Barry's iPhone. If I select auxiliary there, it's showing auxiliary. Now, anything you plug into the auxiliary socket in the center armrest via the auxiliary lead will play through the system, but we want Bluetooth. So what we do, click over to the left, select the phone that you want to play music from, click OK. That's it there. It's playing. If I turn it up, um, if I turn this up, turn that up, there you see, it, it, the title tracks come up anyway, so you'll know it's playing. But if I turn this up quickly, that's it. That's how you uh, play music. Thanks for watching.